Hey guys, and welcome back to Vitamin Y Season 5, and we are using the new deck called Blacker Wings. So, pretty much I came up with it, well, I wanted to do it, oh my god, it's loud. Uh, I've always liked Zephyro, you know, Zephyro's always been a really cool card in the Yubel deck, how you can just play a Zephyro and then just pop the limit reverse back to your hand, so that was always been a good play. But then another card that piqued my interest now was Gale, because of Blue Eyes Silver Dragon, so that's definitely a play that I'm hoping to do in this round. Well, maybe not in this round, but eventually with this deck. Hmm. Well, I can summon him again, mate. Drop a dark, of course. Uh, if you guys don't know, Blue Eyes Silver Dragon coming out in the structure deck, I believe. Drop you bell. And we're going to special summon Graffer. I mean, right now it really just looks like a uh, bell deck, but it pretty much is, you know. Uh, I just flashed in a few of the Black Wings. Activate Graffer Effect, drop my Armageddon Knight to the drop. I'm thinking about Zephyro, but I should go with Tinker. Nah, nah, I'll be safe. I'll go with Zephyro. Where are you? There you are. And then I can activate the... No, I don't, I don't want to do that. I'll probably bounce back the limit reverse. So, we're going to go for... They're going to be a deck. We're going to go for Shockmaster this time, and the game's not going to crash. We're going to go Shockmaster. Okay. Going, no crashing game. No crashing. I know last time you crashed and that sucked butt. Monster. Is that okay? Okay, game. If this game just crashes every time I use Shockmaster, then they screw it. Go ahead. So, uh, I don't have a hand anymore, but you know what? That was a pretty good opening play. So, if you guys don't know what Blue Eyes Silver Dragon does, I'll, I'll try to show it to you. Because uh, he's actually pretty good. Okay, he's a tuner and one or more non-tuner normal monsters. So if I go like swing, doom shaman, and summon Gale, oh, uh, he surrendered. <laughs> I don't blame him because you know Shockmaster's a dick. So uh, you know if you can first turn Shockmaster sometimes, it can be kind of an asshole. But I, I'm gonna go over this card. So you can swing, doom shaman, and summon Gale, cut your opponent's monster in half, and then sink for him. He's level nine. Um, when this card is special summoned, until the end phase of the turn, dragon type monsters you control cannot be targeted or destroyed by card effects. Pretty much almost all of the synchro monsters that this deck goes for are uh, dragons. Uh, Black Blue Drago, Void Ogre, Stardust, Scrap. Um, they're pretty much all dragons. I think the only one that you, that's not a dragon, I think, probably be Crimson Blader, but he's not in this deck. Okay. Now, that effect is fine. But this is where the effect where you, you know, I started jogging my ideas. Once per turn during your standby phase, you can target one normal monster in your graveyard, special summon that target. Okay, so I have Blue Eyes Silver Dragon. During my standby phase, summon a normal monster. Uh, Doom Shaman. Doom Shaman, then summon Tinker. Sync for eight. So every single turn, as long as this guy's on the field, I can be doing synchroing plays. So that's the, re the reason why I wanted to do this deck. So I was like, you know what? Instead of just tossing in Zephyro, because I like him in uh, Gale, how about I go all out and just do a kind of a Black Wing U Bell deck? And it was really hard to do it because it was kind of like I was trying to balance the cards and stuff. So eventually I'll do the deck profile, but right now I'm just working with it. But I did first turn Shockmaster, so I guess it's looking okay right now. So this was too short, so I'll be right back and we'll do another duel. Alright, I'm back. So we're going to go for another round and see maybe if I can go into some Black Wing plays. Maybe? Okay, this hand isn't bad. Uh, we run a Vayu, because, you know, Vayu's pretty good. Uh, he can go off with the Greffer plays, which is probably what I'm going to attempt to do. So I'm going to probably be like Greffer, drop Vayu, drop, probably you bell. You can move this card from play plus one non-tuner Blackwing monster. And special summon a Blackwing Synchro from your extra deck. Okay, so that's how it works. Alright, that's fine. So let me try to do this play. So, I'm going to summon Greffer. Is that okay? I'm going to use Greffer's effect. I'm going to drop value to then drop Ebel. Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> no. It's not. <laughs> it's not by use one. I, I don't even know. That sounds weird. And then we're gonna drop... Yeah, we're gonna drop Shura. So then I can go for the Synchro Play. I think that's how that would work. So can I activate the effect or no? This card in the graveyard, you can play this card plus one black. Not too much in the graveyard, just special something with black Greek secret monster from your extra deck whose level is equal to the total level of the removal play monsters. So, how do I do it? Because I really don't know how to do it. I should be able to go for, what, this guy, right? Oh, it must be Synchro Summoned. Oops. Oh, my bad. <laughs> oh well, that's fine. I messed up. Well, let me get a piece of this cake right here. Alright, well, I should take him out. See, I'm learning something every day. Okay. I guess that play would be a little bit too easy. <laughs> well, I'm going up against heroes. So, I'm going to kill a Spark Man. I'll set two cards. Set the limit reverse, and then I'll set Call the Haunted. Alright, well. See? See, I'm learning every day, because I already messed up. <laughs> so I can't even go for that guy. And I don't have a level 6 Blackwing in here, so I can't even go for Armor Master. Oh well. It was a, it was a good idea. It was a good idea. I should have read the card a little bit more. Wow. That's fun. That is perfectly fine, sir. <laughs> you just want to keep on going with it, don't you? Are we done? May I have my Terra Incarnate, sir? Or are you going to activate another one? Yes! I was like, God, man, just let me have my damn Terror Incarnate! Why do you want to be so mean? Terror! There we go. That's all I wanted. <laughs> And now, what? Hope it was worth the neg. <laughs> you got like some big play that you want to do? I mean, you only got a Sparkman in the graveyard, so I don't see a Miracle Fusion. Hero Blast? Okay. Okay. How come he didn't use that? Target one elemental hero, normal monster. Yeah, trying to read your damn card. Really, Grandma? Oh, this is gonna get annoying. Go ahead. Yep. Go ahead, bounce me back. Of course, he has Grandma in his damn hand. Yes. Love to activate my evil effect summon also nightmare. But that is going to get annoying. <laughs> yep. That is also fine. So one of them is a grand mold, so one of them is I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna put him a card behind. Almost I'm in my grabber. Act as activate his effect, drop the frickin' Evel. And we're gonna drop Zephyrel. Yeah, we're gonna drop Zephyrel. So when I activate the call and like summon you bell, I can just return the call to my hand and summon Zephyr. So that, that plays pretty good. Pretty good. So we're gonna attack his photon thrasher and then we're gonna attack him directly. You wanna drop an honest? Drop an honest. Please drop an honest. <laughs> nah. No. That'd be kinda funny if he did, because that'd be a lot of damage. No, it wouldn't be nothing because he gains what? My attack? I was thinking of the one uh guy from 
uh, War Gods Fujin so doubles their attack, my bad. It's like, wait, what does Honest do again? It's been such a long time since I've seen them, since not a lot of the light decks are tier anymore, or top tier anymore. So go ahead, some of your grand will be a card behind me. That's what my pretty much my plan is, is for you to be a card behind me. So you can summon your grand mole, attack my Yuval. Okay. That's fine. No. Okay, you're gonna summon two light monsters? Two Sparkmen, and you're gonna go for Paladimino, right? Am I right? Is that what you're gonna go for? Because I think that's what you're gonna go for. Paladimino. Yeah, go for it. Go. Paladimino. Now. Go. Go. Do it. Oh! How did I know? <laughs> Paul Domino is so good. Like, he's not even neg. Like, he negates an effect, he drops their attack to zero, and when he's destroyed, you get to draw a card. Like, that's just so good. Like, that's really good. I don't know why you can't target you, though. I have no idea why you cannot. Is it because my attack... Hmm. Maybe because... Pala... Talking about your control. And if it does... Okay. Because you have to make my attack zero to negate my effect. I'm already at zero. That's it. Wow, so every single time I've been doing a person with Paladino, I've been misplaying, because I haven't even read the card. Paladino has to reduce the attack to zero to then get negate the effect. See? Reduces attack to zero, and if it does, its effect is negated. I'm already at zero. It's like a slifer. Wow, okay, so he can't even do that. Wow, that's really good. Wow, I've been messing up this entire time with Paladino. Oh, well. Well, now I know, but he'll still get to draw a card, so I guess that's good. But he's still going to be taking some damage, but... That's really awesome. <laughs> I did not know. I I should have read the card. I was just like, Tyler Domino, he reduces your attack to zero and negates your effect. But I didn't know that you have to reduce the attack to zero, and then if you do negate the effect. Should have read a little bit more. But it's okay. See, I'm learning a lot today. I am learning a lot. Awesome. Limit reverse. That's cool. Uh, I don't really need it right now, though. I mean, what's in here? Hmm. Huh. I can attack with you, Bell. I can activate Call. I can summon Greffer. I can attack him with Greffer. I can second main phase. I can return the Ultimate Nightmare to my hand because he's just gonna bounce it anyway. Summon Zephyro. Uh, XC for. Well, there's really nothing much I can do. I might as well just keep it slow. I mean, I'm, I'm probably still going to call the Greffer, just to make him a card behind when it comes to uh, Grand Mole, because that's what I like to do with Grand Mole, just be a card up on him. But yeah, I'm, that's two things that I learned today. Learning a lot. Learning a lot. So go ahead and draw your card. Then I'm going to activate Call, and I'm going to bring back... Bring back Greffer. I'm going to bring back Greffer. So, if he, bounce, he does bounce my Ubel, I can just use Greffer's effect to send it to the graveyard, to send something else to the graveyard. Uh, poke you with that. So, uh, pretty much, you're in a bind right now. Then, second main phase, I'm going to set the limit reverse. And you can go ahead, sir. Alright, so... Might want to take out... Well, Vayu is still good, because if you use it with Shura, that's still a good play. Like, Shura, attack, summon Vayu, and then sink for 5. His effect is negated, so I can circle for it whatever I want. C catastrophe, but there's no level 5 Black Wing that I can really do, so... That's where it, I draw the line and how good he is. So, Grand Mole, bounce my u -bell, and then I attack you directly for game, so pretty much you're in a bind. So, unless you got some back row. You might be in a little bit of trouble. Oh, that's smart. That's smart too. But I could just summon it next turn. But 
So you're still in trouble, so... You're not out of trouble yet. Because I could just normal summon it next turn, which is what I'll do, and then I'll attack you directly for game. Unless you have something. If you have something... It's like a main phase, sent some cards, set a mirror force or a D-Prison or something, because I think that's what you're going to do. No. Mmm, Tinker. Alright, so I'm thinking maybe it's a mirror force. So I'm going to turn you belt to defense. I'm going to normal summon Greffer. I'm going to get bottomless. <laughs> You know what? I'm not going to use Greffer's Effect. I am not going to use Greffer's Effect. But this call is not attached to anything anymore, so I might as well summon Zephyro and return the call to my hand. No. Now, it might be a mere Force or Torrental. Uh, no, that's fine. That's fine. So I'm gonna set this, and you can go ahead, sir. So it was a torrent. Okay, that's fine. Nah, not nothing to fret over that. So please don't tell me you're gonna summon a grand mole and poke me with it, because if you do, I'm gonna kill it. Stratos, wow. Okay. No, that's fine. So what do you add, alias? Uh, that's fine. I'll take the damage. I don't want him to second main phase do anything to me. I want to be like, I end, activate, limit, reverse, and just kill him. There we go. Yes. Let me reverse. No. No. So, when this card destroys an opponent's match by battle sent to the graveyard, you can spell. Does he have to be on the field to resolve his effect? I have no idea. That's what I'm wondering right now, so... I'm gonna learn some more. Put Terra in attack mode. So, if you attack it, you're gonna take the damage, so. I'm gonna summon Shura, and let's see if I have to be on the field to resolve my effect. If you want to mirror force me, you're still in trouble, so. Do I have to be on the field to resolve my effect? Yes, I do. Okay, that's fine. Hmm. Should I go for the kill? Or should I be safe? I mean, if he tries to grammar he, me, he's gonna take the damage, so... I think I should just be safe and not do anything. Not activate the call, because I don't, still don't know what that is, so... Go ahead. I'm sitting pretty okay right now. No. So, Grand Mole will kill yourself. Because you take the damage before you bounce, so... What are you going to do, sir? Do you have a nice spark? Okay, I guess nothing. No? What's fine. Hmm. I didn't put any sixes in here, so I definitely should put a six in here. If I had a six, it'd be game, but I don't have a six, so I learned something new again. I need to put a six in here. Uh, uh go ahead. I'll just kill you, and you can go right ahead. Gemini Spark, I saw that coming. Yes. It really doesn't matter. I mean, I'm gonna lose it anyway, so I might as well 
use it. <laughs> it doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. Because I don't have another terror, so... I don't like to play more than one terror, so... It doesn't matter, summon the Yvelle, then dies, and you get to draw a card. So let's see what he does. I mean, he's up on me with cards, so he's sitting pretty good when it comes to card-wise. At life point-wise, he's in deep shit. Can't even grand mole me anymore. Can't even grand mole me anymore, so what you gonna do? Just set a monster? That's it? Okay. Swing. Well, I don't have Jin Shaman in the graveyard. I should have put him in the graveyard, but I don't have him in the graveyard. So that kind of sucks. What are we waiting on? Is he gonna veil me or what? Waiting, waiting, waiting. Come on. Okay. I end. Is it Grand Mole or something different? Okay, some noble knight guy. Okay. So now what? What are you going to do, sir? Just keep setting monsters, I guess. I mean, that's really pretty much the only thing you can do. If he leaves himself open, I'll kill him. And if he summons Grandma and tries to bounce me, he'll kill himself, so... Wow, come on, I need to send... I need to get, like, a monster, you know? Something to send Doomsham to the graveyard. Once I get that, I will be okay. <sighs> I'm trying to end this really quickly, okay? Yeah. Sorry, I was talking to my mom. <sighs> but this guy just doesn't want to quit. Just die! <laughs> Does he have any water? No, he just has light and stuff, so he can go for a shining with Miracle Fusion, but that's not going to be enough to save him. No? I mean, he's pretty much in a conundrum. He can just keep on setting monsters. I have heavy and MST, so I can just wipe your back row and kill you when I'm ready, but I just don't have it right now. So, if I get an Armageddon Knight or a Greffer, I will indefinitely just wipe your back row, summon... Okay, you're gonna kill yourself. You're gonna kill yourself. Like, you will lose if you do this. So I hope it's worth it. You lose. You just died. Maxi that's fine, you still lose. <laughs> oh my god. He's like, Maxine, I'm sure, go ahead, you still lose. <laughs> so I learned a lot from this, so uh, I'll probably name this episode that. But uh, tell me what you think of the deck so far. I mean, it's pretty fun. Like, right now, it's looking pretty fun. I need to tune it up a little bit. Uh, I didn't know that that black guy, the level 5 black one, Synchro guy can only be summoned from Synchro Summon because you can't even value him. I mean, he wasn't that good anyway, but I kind of went for more damage anyway, so that's where I messed up. So, uh, go ahead and give this video a like if you like this deck, and I'll keep on working on it, and I will see you guys tomorrow. So, thanks for watching.